Hello, I'm Z, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. I want to do GI Blues. I do. Maybe these two, the Whitewash and GI Blues. Hmm, yeah. Talk to Julie Farkas and see if the followers know anything about the situation. And who would the followers be? Shit, we got three waypoints. Dismiss all your companions. I don't want to do that. Welcome, sir Orman. Show me what you have. Cause I don't have a lot of money. I don't think I have gold bars on me, so let me check just let me check. Actually I do. Surprisingly. Wow. Alright, then I'll take a bunch of 12 gauges. And, you know, just a bunch of them. Oh, yeah. Grenades. I don't know what I just bought. I bought something that was really expensive. He's got to give me 2,000, but I don't know what I took. Oh, a submachine gun that I don't need. Alright, that's good, that's good. I just want the money. Hmm. What about these boys, though? How do I get in? Like, that's a good-ass question. Well, then we'll go in free side and figure it out from there. What a busy town. You tell me there's someone this way? I don't quite think so, right? Maybe you are. Hello. Don't think I've seen your face before. Are you a citizen of the NCR? Sure am. I just recently arrived here from California. You don't look like you're from around here, so I guess I can believe that. Just head to the northwest part of town, by the old train station. We start handing out supplies at 6 every night. There'll be some guards by the door, but just remember that the password is HOPE, and they'll let you by right quick. Okay. Who are you? Why are you waving? Who are you? Why are you dragging me over here? Check it out. Between the dumpsters there. Friend of yours? Nah, just some idiot that wandered down the wrong alley. Sound familiar? No, no, it doesn't. It really doesn't. It really, really doesn't. Thank you, Boone. Yeah. Seems like you were the one who wandered down the wrong alley. Didn't expect to have your head disintegrated in the first two seconds of combat. Yeah, not many do. Not many do. Uh, ask, uh, ask around the squatter camp to find a leak regarding... Okay. Northwest part of Freeside. Alright, but what's over here? What's this objective? Hello again. Remember to stop by one of these nights. Northwest, by the old train station. By the old train station, Northwest. Sure. Contact. Hmm. Mick and Ralphs. We we'll have a wasteland, and we're supposed to be going over there, maybe. Hmm. 
We've got places to be going. That's that's the point. Every night at six, they said, right? So does that is that actually every night or every morning at six? It's uh, six isn't really a night kind of hour. Either morning morning or afternoon, really. You look like a person in need of a good meal. You wouldn't happen to be an NCR citizen, would you? I sure am. Now, it's not that I don't believe you, but I'm gonna have to give you a little quiz to verify your citizenship status. That okay with you? Lay it on me. That's a good attitude. I'm sure you'll do fine. These are just a few questions that just about anyone in the NCR would know. Alright, here we go. First question. Who was the most popular president in NCR history? Peterson, Tibbet, Kimball, or Tandy? You fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? Kimball. Uh-huh. Okay, second question. What was the original name of the NCR capital? Aradesh, Shady Sands, The Boneyard, or Vault 13? Shady Sands, I think. Right. Fine, then. Last question. What animal is on the NCR's flag? A two-headed bear, an eagle, a two-headed snake, or a two-tailed lion? Two-headed bear, but it's more like two bears fucking. Oh, I'm sorry. Hmm. I've got a hundred caps here that say I'm loyal to the NCR. I'm, I'm a loyal LCR, NCR citizen. Now I know you're from the NCR. None of the vagrants around here would even think of giving their money away. We're located up by the old train station in the northwest part of town. Just tell the guards hope and they'll let you through. Best of luck. Best of luck for the same info I already knew. Thank you. NCR. That was happening here. Why is that mole rat friendly? Huh? We're gonna have rat tonight. Oh. You're hunting it, eh? Could go there, or I could do go to the old Mormon fort and ask around there, I guess. Or whatever I might need help with. I'm guessing over here. No? One else. Over in the fort. Oh, someone's above. That's why I'm trying to talk to no one. Hey, Farkas. Hey, good to see you. Right. Do you know anything about the NCR soldiers here in Freeside? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. What about it? The king thinks these troops have been attacking locals. I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really look into it. If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of the operations here in Freeside, though she won't open up to you right away. If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. Was there anything else you wanted to talk about? You said something about helping addicts? Yes, old Bill Ronte and Jacob Hoff. They're not going to kick their habits on their own. Where should I start looking? I'll see what I can do to help them. Sobering them up and putting them back to work would go a long way toward helping Freeside. Tell me about Bill. Old Bill Ronte is an exceptionally skilled machinist. He yeah, I gotta find him first of all, so... Do you sell Marikos place? Yep. I'd buy any stim pack I find. And that I will do. Well, it seems like I got another... Another quest. Just keep getting them, huh? I could go exploring some more, but I do actually want to do some other stuff, too. But now I've got the wrong quest. Or, no, I don't.
Right. Just there. How does one get there? Oh, I'm dressed as an NCR member, huh? And they didn't believe me as being an NCR. Okay. I'm not. I'm not gonna question it. I'm just gonna, you know, make my way over there. What are you doing here? The king controls the water pump. How much? How much for a drink? Just a few. Never mind. The pump is property of the king. You'll need to pay if you want to drink. I know. I heard you the first time. Really don't need you to repeat it. it. Looks like I haven't explored around here, but I can just go around. Seems. It's pretty nice. There they are. Very inconspicuous, might I say. Hold up. What's the password? It's hope. Go ahead. Here you go. I hope this helps. Turn the king and inform him. First of all. Try to take only what you need. You. Welcome. There's food and water here for any citizen of the NCR. Please, have some. Are you with the NCR military? Yes. I'm a major in the Supply Corps, which is where this food and water comes from. Do you serve food to the locals as well? No, I'm afraid we don't. Don't you have a friend you wanted to bring in? Yes, but I was afraid he wouldn't get served. You were right. But here... Take another helping for your friend. It'll be our secret. Yes? Was it? Why don't you serve the locals? That's not really a pleasant topic of conversation. Let's just say we have our reasons. Judy Farkas told me to ask. Said it was important. You know Julie? Not everyone in the NCR sees eye to eye with the followers. But they're okay in my book. Mostly because of her. If you really want to know, we sent an envoy to the king. Offering to coordinate the relief effort. The king refused? In a manner of speaking. Our envoy was brutally beaten and only barely survived. My superiors ordered the relief mission scrapped. I managed to get clearance to carry out the mission anyway, but with greatly reduced support. Now there's not enough supplies to go around, even if I wanted to serve the rest of Freeside, which I don't. That's all in the past now. I should get back to work. Say hi to Julie for me. I see. That fiend leader shouldn't have messed with our great army. I see. I think I'll just go to the east gate. I think it's faster to enter through here. Although it does make a lot of sound. Make it mouse. Did they, did they have anything interesting? Hey, Mick. Or hey, Ralph. Hey, what can I get you? Oh, you have a stock. Nothing too interesting. But I know you have a secret stop. I only off. Who's the king? I know who the king is. Never mind. I have other questions, though. Welcome back. What guns do you have for sale? Nuka Breaker. <laughs> uh, Followers are looking to work us out a supply deal. Are they looking to buy guns? No. Then talk to my partner, Ralph. Okay. I'd like to browse your special inventory. Let's see it. Like I always say, a polite society is an armed society. Perfect. Do you have any... Um... Of gauge? A lot of them, actually. Nice. I like that.
BBs. Like I even need them. Grenade machine gun. I'm sorry, but that just that just sounds really stupid and really fun. But I ain't got the explosives or the strength to use it properly, so maybe maybe in a different lifetime, you know. Little devil. Shit, that costs an arm and a leg. What the? F what the fuck is that weapon? What about damage? It's pretty decent. I don't got the strength to use it though. Bonus critical chance. Well, thanks. Let's say you have some interesting stuff. Hey, Ralph. Hey, what can I get? Yeah, you? followers. Uh, I already talked to you about setting up. No. Might have, might have. People say the cons got wiped out of Red Rock. That's one less bunch of. Yeah, I Take killed them out. all. Well, I'm glad I can be of help to the king, but I'm also not one to really make friends with the wrong guy. He seems like a bit of a jackass. We've got stuff we're not even allowed to sell, people. Good. Good. School of impersonation. The kings. Alright, king. Where are you? You're over here. Nice and easy to get to. You find out something about them soldier boys yet? The NCR is... Distributing supplies in a building down by the old train station. Handing out supplies? Like food and stuff? That ain't nothing to get ruffled over. You find anything else? Uh, they're only ha only handing out supplies to NCR citizens. Ah, that would explain the goons. They're here to keep people like my friends away from the food. That ain't something I support. No, sir. They said someone was sent to discuss this issue with you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. They said what? Uh, they said the man was severely beaten and barely survived. Huh, that would explain why they're all riled at us. Seems like we have a big misunderstand. What the hell? What's happening? King, we've got problems. Lay it on me. What's going on? There's a shootout going down near the train station. It's Pacer and some strangers. Might be NCR. What is that fool doing? I need you to head out there and try to defuse the situation. Tell them I'm willing to cooperate. Oh, fair enough. Fair enough, King. It seems someone wasn't as loyal as he thought. Come to the Silver Rush for all your energy weapon needs. That sounds nice. Where is that Silver Rush? Not somewhere I've been. You want someone dead. I don't doubt the liquor store that's closed. Silver Rush. Oh, would you look at that? I'm afraid I'm going to have to search you before letting you in. The only weapons allowed on the premises are the ones we're selling. Okay, search away. It should only take a moment. There. I've stored all of your weapons. You're clear to enter. When you leave, I'll hand them all back to you. Thanks. The bosses are having a meeting. You'll have to wait Mr. until it's Storm, over. Please get to the point. The second you half of your payment you really is late, and I want to know why. I'm not paid to talk. Been hey. Hey. I get attacked for that. I get attacked for that. For walking past. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before he? leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality What's of the happening? weapons is below expectation and hope to adjust the price accordingly. Ah, I think I understand what the issue here is. Yeah? Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. Oh shit. Aren't okay, you a bit? Show's over. 
Back to work. Aren't you a serious bunch? Welcome to the Silver Rush, where only top-of-the-line energy weapons can be found. What can I do for you? I was wondering if I had any work available. It just so happens a position opened up recently. We currently need another body to guard the entrance outside. Think you can handle that? Sure, got me in. Wonderful. I already have a man outside who can show you the ropes and get you set up. His name is Simon. He's been with the family for years, so listen to what he says and follow his instructions. Fair, but I'd also... Back. Mind if I some questions? What do you think of the gunrunners? There are chief competitors in this region and many others. That makes them our enemies. While I respect their business acumen, I'm obligated to try to destroy them however I can. That's business, after all. Hmm. I'm not really gonna ask you about other things. I don't care enough. What about your Welcome stock, back. though? Hmm. Cleansing flame. I like the sound of that. I don't have enough money to get it, but I like the sound of that. That's 151 DPS. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. 129 is what this is. HP minus 2, 5 seconds effect. And this one was, wasn't it? Minus 8 for 6 seconds. That's so much better. Sorry, that's so much better. Yeah, no, I'm just depressed. That's all. What is this? What's that? God damn. Ain't you got some fucking interesting weapons? Welcome to the Sylve. Ah, oh, crap. Don't tell me you're my new guard. That's right. Well, no time for pleasantries. I've got your gear right here, but let's see if you can follow instructions. You'll be covering the other side of the door there. Take your position while I get your stuff out. Here? Good. Look around and get a feel for where customers and risks can enter and exit the area. I get your gear ready. I mean, just about anywhere. Literally at a corner, so everywhere is somewhere they can come and go. Okay, now let's get you geared up. First, your armor. Standard issue is your run-of-the-mill combat armor with a nice dark coat of paint for both brand recognition and sheer intimidation value. Next, your weapon. Guards are required to use rifles. Anything lighter compromises your combat effectiveness. Anything heavier and people are too scared to come in the door. What's your preference, laser or plasma? What's the difference? Lasers have a high rate of fire, but not a lot of stopping power. Plasma, on the other hand, is slow as a mule, but with a kick to match. So, what'll it be? Plasma. Nothing wrong with going plasma. Just make sure you hit what you're aiming at. Now that you're equipped, a quick word on the job at hand. In a nutshell, we're here to keep the riffraff away. Drunks, punks, and capless vermin are to be turned away. Potential customers are to be permitted normal entrance. That is, after we pat them down for weapons. An unarmed man is a lot less likely to try to steal something with several armed guards around. Yep. Don't start any fights. I don't care if some jet junkie just insulted your mother. We're here to promote violence elsewhere, not start it here. Lastly, don't abandon your post. We're getting paid to stand next to this door, not talk to someone down the street or head to the casino. That goes double for any thoughts of splitting with that gear. Every now and then, some young punk thinks he can run off with Van Graaff property. Trust me, the rifle and armor are nice, but they're not worth your life. Other than that, Relax. There's usually some eye candy coming and going from the Wrangler over there at some point, so the view's not too bad. I see, so we just guarded. Settle in. You've got some hours left before your shift ends. Is this really what we're doing? Because the E just told me I can't quit here. Here comes a winner. I'll let you handle this one. Hi there. Is 
Is this where I can pick up a laser gun? Sorry, sir, but I can't let you in. Company policy. Sounds like a stupid policy to me. Good. Stick to the rules. Yeah. Another one coming. You're on. Where? You couldn't even see him. No. You're lying. You're bluffing. These are staged. They're hard, hard actors. Professionals. Here to do my training. Uh, hi. I was, uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by to look at your weapons. Can I go in? We're gonna have to search you first. Fine by me. He's clean. See? Not so hard, is it? Yeah. Heads up. Looks like we got another customer. True. Come on over. Pass there if you could. Howdy. I just done broke the bank over at the Wrangler there and thought I might peruse your fine wares. Maybe lighten my purse a little? Certainly, sir. We need to pat you down for weapons first. Now, hold on here. I'm not packing any heat. Ain't my word good enough for you? I'm sure you're a man of your word, sir. We still need to pat you down. No exceptions. I suppose it's all right. If there's no other choice. He's clean. See? Told you so. Hmm. Looks like that guy's headed this way. Don't screw it up. That guy? At the end of the road? Yeah. Sure wish he'd walk faster. I ain't got all day. I gotta help the kings too, you know? What an interesting and weird quest at the same time. We're definitely gonna end up fighting someone. Or they'll, they'll pick a fight with us. Because otherwise I think it would be just a bit too boring. Hey Boone. I don't think this is the guy that we're gonna fight though. Hey, looking for something to replace my old revolver. Mind if I head in? Sorry, we're gonna have to search you first. That's not really necessary, is it? I already told you I got this here revolver, right? It's company so uh, policy. Now you're gonna let us search you or what? Damn, I knew this wasn't gonna work. Hey! Hmm. Thanks, Boone. What he was the one. Suppose that was about? Revenge note. And barter plus five, I'll take that. Don't talk to me, rookie. Help me clean this up. No one's going to want to shop here with a corpse out front. Right, yeah, let's see that revenge note. To whom am I concerned? If you're reading this, then I am likely dead. I can only hope that this that I've managed to take down some of the those thrice damned man graphs with me. My family deserved that much, at least. Don't talk to me, rookie. All right, shut up. Crap. It's just about closing time. Let's go see the boss about getting paid. Oh, I'm gonna need the rifle and armor back. Boss's orders. Sure. Hello. Hey. Simon's been telling me how it went. Let's do a quick recap. You kept away the undesirables, patted down the rest for weapons, and kept your cool. That is to say, you performed as instructed. Simon was impressed, and so am I. So you get a small bonus with your normal pay. Unfortunately, I found someone else with a little more experience, and he'll take over the position starting tomorrow. However, another task has come up that I could use some help with, assuming you're still interested in making some money. Yeah, sure. There's a deal that we've been working on for a while now, and the buyer would like a sample of our weapons. I need you to run a package out to a discreet location that the client has chosen. Sound good? Of course. I'll do it. Good. Here's the package. I'll mark the location on your map. The buyer said they'd be in town for quite a while, so there's no rush. That said, try not to dawdle. 
This client could mean big money for us, which naturally means big money for you. Sure. Hey. And where's that location? Oh, that's very close by. Where's the shootout king? Oh, he oh, it's here, but okay. You there, keep your hands so we can see him. Draw a weapon and we will fire. We just put on NCR clothing. You. This isn't really a good time. What did you want? King wants to help with the relief effort. Like he helped the envoy we sent? <laughs> no thanks. That wasn't him. He didn't even know an envoy was sent. Then he should watch his back. We know for a fact that the envoy made it to their headquarters. Still, if the King's willing to deal with us, perhaps we can work something out. I'll tell my men to stand down. Right. But for now, birds of a feather. Let's see where that is. Not that far away. We can make it here quite easily. While we're at it, might as well unlock. Eh, well, actually, I don't really feel like unlocking that. But we can make it there quite easily, is what I'm trying to say. Still dressed as a member. Well, no shit. Although the fact that it does tell you, I guess, is a bit helpful. Hmm. I don't know. Right here. My boy with a discreet location. Are you the Van Graaff's emissary? I am. Do you have what we requested? It's right here. Where's the payment? I wasn't informed there was to be an exchange on my part. What are you talking about? My employers managed to negotiate a small fee for this job a short time ago. Such a thing is possible. I've been out in the field for some time. Fine. This should cover your grievance. Now the package, if you will. Right here. Ah. Then our business is concluded. Tell your superiors that we will contact them shortly. There. Hmm. Precise North Gate should be faster to get to the Kings, right? Because I want to stop by there. I do like the idea of having the kings, aka just Elvis Presley's everywhere. I find it quite funny. And, you know, entertaining. King. I heard all about what happened. Maybe it's time for a little more talking and a little less fighting. You've helped us plenty, so I'll tell you what. Just this once, name whatever you want. And if I can make it happen, it's done. Don't rush it, though. Toss it around in your head a little. You only get one favor from the king. Things have been a lot better mm. since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So, what can I do for you? Building is interesting. What do you know about it? Where'd you get that robot dog? Oh, Rex here. What about him? He doesn't seem very happy. He goes through spells like this from time to time. The followers said his brain is going bad or something. Can I help somehow? I don't know. Maybe. If you found a way to help my poor Rex here, I'd be much obliged. Your best bet will be to talk to Julie Farkas over at the old Mormon fort north of here. 
Maybe you'll have better luck than I did. Hmm. Sure. Nothing but a hound dog. What would that favor you owe me? I want to join the kings. Can you get me into the strip? Will you use some money? I want to join the kings. Normally, we don't let outsiders join. But I think I can make an exception in your case. I'll have one of the guys spread the word. From this day forward, you're one of us. And no one in Freeside will mess with you if they know what's good for them. In addition, if you want to do something about that hair of yours, talk to Sergio. I'll let him know you're coming. Perhaps more importantly, you've earned the right to wear something a little more stylish. Here, wear it proudly. Thanks. Hey, Rex. We're gonna get you sorted out, too. Don't you worry. Now I'm part of the Kings. Lasers, plasma, pistols, grenades. We've got it all at the Silver Rush. I'd like to join everyone if I can, as long as I don't make others unhappy. Through that decision. Welcome back. Did you have... Yeah, I delivered the package. And? Don't leave me in suspense. What was their reaction? He said you'd hear from them soon. Good. Good. Here's your payment. If you'll excuse me, I have some thinking to do. Oh. Jean-Baptiste was talking about a matter earlier that he needs help with. I volunteered you. See him for the details. Who? You? Even ah, just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? Absolutely. All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Glory negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you'd probably see in a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. Can you tell me anything more? Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. But this girl and I, we need to have a discussion. Find her. Bring her here so I could talk to her one-on-one. -on -one. You know where she is? Fuck no. If I knew where this bitch was, you think I'd be asking you? Still, there's someone who might. Old Alice McLafferty. Crimson Caravan might know something. She keeps tabs on caravan traffic in the Mojave. Wouldn't put it past her to keep track of Cassidy Caravans and its owner. Uh, I'll do it. Find her, bring her back here so we can talk. Needless to say, there's some good money in it for you. Fair enough. This thing is one hell of a... One hell of a beautiful weapon. Evening. Hmm, what's in there, I wonder? Am I allowed in here? I'm gonna guess yes, since it's just bathrooms. All kinds. Alright, well I'm gonna I'm gonna also leave it here since I'm out of time. So if you enjoyed this episode, leave it a like. Have an awesome rest of the day, and I'll see you tomorrow.